Hey, this is Josh Burns with Overcome Everything, and I've got a video for you today on how to make horrendous squeeze pages that suck a lot and just don't work well. First, I want to talk about why you'd want a terrible squeeze page. Uh, well, you'd want a terrible squeeze page because, you know, your current squeeze page is converting so many um, visitors into subscribers that your list is growing too fast and it's making you nervous. You know, you'd want a horrible squeeze page because your business is so consistent and it's doing so well that you, you, you feel weird and you want to get back to, you know, the, the, the fun of uh, struggling with your business and always trying to get people on, to join your list. That, these are the, the kinds of reasons why you'd want a terrible squeeze page. So I'm going to give you some advice uh, that you can implement right away to, uh, to improve your horrible results. Um, the first thing that you're going to want to do is to, instead of using the clear language and the, you know, um, really sort of simple commands and, and, and language that you, you have on your squeeze page now, Switch to a lot of industry jargon, technical language, um, anything you can do to obfuscate. You, the word obfuscate is really good to use. Um, what you what you actually want to say. Um, use passive voice as much as possible. These are the kinds of things that are really going to help um, decrease your your conversion on your squeeze page. Another thing you're going to want to do is to um, is to rely heavily on images and video. Uh, it, the longer it can take for the images to load up, the better, because you want people deciding to leave your squeeze page before they get a chance to opt in, because they're still waiting for everything to load. Same thing with video. You know, they say a picture's worth a thousand words. Well, if you think about it, a video is thousands of pictures, so you know, and plus some audio thrown in, so it's really worth like a small library. Um, and, and, you know, if you're going to have a video on your squeeze page, how many words is that? Just the, you know, you can't possibly understand what is actually being communicated to everybody who sees your squeeze page. So throw up a really long video um, that rambles on and on and, and doesn't really uh, do anything for the people watching it. And they'll leave almost right away. Um, and, and, you know, that brings up an interesting question of where will they go? Well, I've got a theory that uh, universally, um, if somebody's going to leave your squeeze page, they're going to go watch videos of cute cats. So you can feel good that by driving people away from your squeeze page, you're increasing the number of videos and pictures of cute cats that are being viewed on a daily basis, which, as we all know, is really, really good for the human race. Now... The third uh, secret to you know cr creating horrible, horrendous, terrible squeeze pages is to um, talk about features almost exclusively and ignore any of the benefits. People want to know you know what's in it for me. You know they want to know <clears throat> what it is that you know you can offer them. Um, in exchange for signing up that would benefit them long term. So what you want to do is focus only on the features. Tell people all the little technical details you can. Show them all the graphs and pie charts you can. But don't tell them what it means for them and, and for their lives. So these are some three really simple ways that you can take your squeeze pages and make them terrible so that people won't opt in. Now, if you want some good advice for not having horrible squeeze pages and for actually converting a lot of your your traffic into you know customers and and subscribers that you can send things to and they'll buy from you over time uh for free for years uh then head to this link i'm just going to make sure i get this right here go to www.listbuilding.com forward slash horrendous that's listbuilding.com forward slash h-o-r-r-e-n-d-o-u-s you're going to see a squeeze page there that's only slightly on the horrendous side because we don't want just anybody opting in. And and you're going to opt in there, and then you'll get a video that shows you probably the simplest, most effective method for getting started with email marketing and seeing real profits that um, that you're likely to find. Uh, it's a great video, very helpful, and it, it, the system it reveals is just incredibly, incredibly powerful. And um, you're not going to want to watch it if you do want horrendous squeeze pages because it's just going to put you on the wrong path. Uh, this is Josh Burns for Overcome Everything, hoping you have exactly what you want from your squeeze pages, and I will see you in another video.